Okay, so this is a demo of the um, Female Munden Professionals Photo Lighting Studio. Um, it's a shooting a tent box kit, so and it comes with backdrops. So I just wanted to show how quickly and easily. Um, hopefully how easy it is to assemble. So I really like that it comes in this really nice, um, very portable case. It's a very sturdy case with very sturdy straps. Now there's the instructions here. It's just one, um, one single page. And then, so here are the individual pieces. These are the backdrops. I have taken them out to actually view them to make sure everything is here. These are the actual um, assembly rods to make the square. This is the, um, the lights, the power cord, and then this is a carrying bag. I'm not sure sure for what piece but it's a carrying bag and then these are the little connector pieces so I'm just going to move this out of the way and then I'm just going to go ahead and try to get started so it says use the eight steel pipes and four of the connectors to form the framework so um what I'm probably going to do at this point is I'm not going to talk through it. I'm going to probably speed up the time. So um, just FYI because this might be, well, it shouldn't be too long, but you just never know. So I'm going to stop talking and this will just be a sped up clip. Okay. So it took about 21, about 20, 25, 21 minutes just to get everything in there and together. So, and that is the instruction. So it is now assembled. So I could use, uh, let me turn this on so I can make sure it works. Okay, so the plug is working, but maybe I don't have something in the right hole because the lights aren't coming on. switch or anything so which is odd Okay, so you have to hold. Okay. So the instructions, other than actual, there are no usage instructions, but there are assembly instructions.
and there it has different levels of brightness so you hit it and it will get brighter and you hit it to go dimmer and then you hold it to turn it off hold it to turn it on so I'm gonna take a couple pictures in here and just see how they turn out so thanks for watching let me know what you think let you have you tried light boxes I almost feel like I, this needs to have um, something on the side in order to um, like for me to be able to like put my hand in there which I think I might um, turn the case so that this is the top of it is actually on the side so that way I can just slide like my hand in there to do nail photos to make those turn out much better and to reduce clutter in the background so I think I might have to do that just because I really do um, that was my main purpose not just for like flat lay photos and clearing out backgrounded clutter not having good space but to do nail photos um, and because of the filter here I can't get my hand in through the top um, unless I move this, but this is like a diffuser for the light. So I think I'm going to take this off, flip it so that the opening that's on the top is on the side. So that way I can easily slide my hand in there. So that's it. And I will take some pictures just to show you the different quality. Thanks for watching. Stay polished at all times and have a great day. Bye.